the new girl is so sus. You know, there's a civilized way of solving this. The yellow hill way. Basketball. Rio. Looks like we uh, got the money can't buy happiness and the poor can't buy anything. Dar Dar Binks, Darth Vader, Darn Solo, you know him, Darman, the man that I have for some reason decided to integrate into the Star Wars universe. And today, Darman, for once, I'm on your side. Good old fashioned Darman knockoffs, a phrase that I have not said in quite some time. Now, as many of you probably know, we used to talk about Darman knockoffs all of the time on this channel, but over time, those channels evolved and started to do their own thing and created other things I could criticize other than them being copies of Darman. Now say what you want about Darman, but one thing that nobody can deny is that the man single-handedly changed YouTube, and that is more evident than ever because these channels are still popping up to this day, including the one we're going to be talking about today, Yellow Hill, a life lesson channel that was made in like the last few months that is straight up plagiarizing what Darman does in his YouTube videos. It's almost like it's an AI generated rated life lesson channel or something. I'm not even joking. The catchphrase for the channel is, we're not just telling stories, we're changing lives. Sound familiar? And okay, sure, you could argue that that's a pretty generic tagline. Let's look at the description. So Darman's description reads, don't forget to subscribe to my channel by clicking here. Make sure you click the bell icon so you can get notifications when my next video goes up so you don't miss anything. Huh, I wonder what Yellow Hill's description is. Subscribe to my channel by clicking here. Make sure you click the bell icon so you can get notifications when my next video goes up so you don't miss anything. We're not just telling stories, we're changing lives, so please help my videos change more lives by sharing. Literally word for word. So you might be wondering, okay, they steal all the description, they steal the titles, they steal the tagline. What about the actual videos? Well, that's where they slightly differ. Yellow Hill has like a giant series going on. Every video is sort of a continuation of the last, and Yellow Hill is the name of the private school that these videos are set in, and I'll tell you what, they are hilarious. Not on purpose, but still, they are hilarious. And that's exactly what we're gonna be watching today. Mean Girls shame new cheerleader. What happens is shocking. Now this is the second video on the channel. We're skipping the first one because it's just like the backstory about how a bunch of the main characters were like criminals who got sent to this boarding school, I guess. I, I don't know. I didn't really pay that much attention to it. But I'm realizing this intro is going on for about twice the amount of time that they normally do, so let's stop wasting time, let's just begin. Please subscribe. The new girl is so sus. That is not a great way to start off the video. Did you see your shoes? I know they were gross. Yes! Where did she even get them from? Probably Walmart. Who <laughs> shops there? You talking about Alexa? Yeah. Yeah, she's great. I really like her. What? Oh, you guys should date. Oh, you know, that's not your worst idea. You guys would look so cute together. Oh, except remember how cute we were together? So much better. Aw, Trisky. Stop. Please, just let me be. Oh, he's blushing. He misses you. My god, okay, exposition overload. So we've got some past relationships, a bit of tension in the room. Classic. The problem I'm running into is that I do not care for these characters whatsoever. So this relationship means nothing to me, and it will probably remain that way. Oh, boys. We just talked we about just, this. We were doing <laughs> the discussion. Hi. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Boys. Hi, I'm Becca. And I'm Maria. What's your name? Alexa. So is this like a boarding school, or is this some sort of college dorm? I'm not really sure what the setting here is supposed to be, but I do like the fact that they did not even try to hide that they are filming this in some sort of house. Whatever exterior building they keep showing is definitely not what they're filming in. You're new here, right? Where are you from? Connecticut. Nice, we love the preppy fashion. It's so cute, it's so in right now. What do your parents do? They are lawyers. <gasps> That's so funny. Her parents are lawyers too. Small world. That's, that's not really how that phrase is used, but uh, continue. What car do your parents drive? Um, a Toyota. <laughs> <laughs> My gardener drives a Toyota. <laughs> <laughs> I, I was joking. That's such a good one. Yeah, I am totally joking. Uh, no, my 
parents obviously my parents drive a Lamborghini. I really can't tell if this is some of the worst or some of the best YouTube acting I've ever seen. Purely not being sarcastic, there's a certain quality about it that's not terrible. Maybe it's because it's so bad and it's almost like they know it's bad, so they're not trying too hard. I'm not sure, but it's interesting. Oh my god, what color? Uh, orange. Oh, that's such a nice color. We should write in it sometime. Yeah, we should. We think you're so cool and nice and smart. Yeah. And you know what? We really don't extend this that often. Like, never. But we'd like for you to sit with us. Do people like this actually exist? I mean, you see it so much in media, but in my entire time of going to school, I mean, like, obviously people sat together for different reasons, but I never heard somebody saying like, oh, now that your dad got hired at that law firm, you can come sit with us now if you'd like. Like, has anybody seen something like this happen firsthand? You and Maria, yeah? Yeah, oh, she's, she's a looker, bro, she's a Maria. looker, you see? <laughs> I don't mind it. But, uh, when you saw the eyes, this guy was throwing it, Alexa. Oh, oh yeah, there, There's yeah. something there. I, I felt the tension the in eyes. the room. It was beautiful. <laughs> what are you talking about? It was about? uncomfortable even being in there. Yeah. But... You know, this is just a beautifully constructed scene. We got all the boys sitting around having a nice chat. We've got a basketball. We've got the baseball mid and the baseball. Just classic dude stuff. We've got a dismembered hand that is resting in this guy's lap that um, I would really like addressed. Please, please tell me why that's there. You gotta make sure Hannah doesn't find out. Oof. Okay, okay uh, yeah. just give me a minute to think about this. <laughs> what? <laughs> just, just get out. Just get out. Is he? Is he? Yeah. He's okay. I'm, I'm kicking you out for a second. No, have a, Don't have bring a nice it up little like nap. That. Okay. Yeah, yeah. All right. We're you always bring it up like that. that. Yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. it's okay, man. Yeah. You know it's not okay? The fact that the hand is still there and nobody's talking about it. We're really just gonna gloss over that. Are we serious here? Hi, Miss Brown. Good morning, Miss Brown. Good morning. Good morning. What's up, Teach? Hey, you're Alexa, right? Yes, I am. I just wanted to get to know you a little bit, figure out where you came from. Yeah, I just moved here from Connecticut. Oh, I'm from Connecticut. What school did you study at? Um, well, uh, I just forgot my pencil case. I, I'll see you in class, okay? Why would you not just make something up? It's not like a person knows every single high school in their entire state. Just say something generic. You have 15 minutes left in our class, and you need to answer all of these questions by the ring of the ball. What? So unfair. We just learned this yesterday. That's like a Harvard entrance exam. Seriously. I can't believe this. This is impossible. I guess there's some things money can't buy. You know what? Not all of us spend every night in the library. Some of us have social lives. Tell her back. Um, I'm up. I'm a bit confused. The last scene we saw these three, they had just become best friends. They were all sitting together taking selfies. Why are we roasting each other now? I don't, I don't understand. And what do you mean social life? You presumably live at this school and there's like seven people total. Are you trying to fight? <laughs> okay, let's go. Where and when? Hey, hey, calm down. You know, there's a civilized way of solving this. The Yellow Hill way. Basketball. Basketball. So, one on one? Nah. Team versus team. <laughs> what kind of mid-2000s Disney Channel special buffoonery is this? We're gonna have a basketball match? Are you joking? Does anybody know what I'm watching? Because at this point, I'm not sure. Ladies and gentlemen, there is only one way to solve a dispute at Yellow Hill, and that's by a game of merciless Yellow Hill basketball. Let the games begin. How should we divide teams? Girls first. Easy. I choose my bestie. Let's go, Hannah. <laughs> Andrew. Nah. I'm with Alexa and Hannah. 
Oh, All right. Wanted you we got it. Trio. Looks like we uh, got the money can't buy happiness and the poor can't buy anything. This is either the greatest joke in YouTube history or genuinely the worst piece of media I have ever seen in my entire life. If this is meant to be taken seriously, if this is not some sort of over-the-top parody of YouTube life lesson channels, I've got some rough news for the writers. All right, so no joke for the next five minutes. There is just a montage of Disney Channel basketball playing with some, uh, questionable camera angle choices given the attire of the actresses seems to be some directive decisions that were likely not agreed upon by everybody so yeah this is a very strange channel it almost seems ai generated like i said it just found the key phrases that are most successful in the life lesson genre and then made a very very strange video to go along with it the channel has like seven or eight more videos so if you'd like me to look at the rest of them let me know but yeah just a very peculiar channel well guys what do you think? Do you think that this is a serious channel or just some sort of advanced parody? Obviously, I'd be hoping for the latter, but I think sadly, this is a real channel churning out what are supposed to be real life lessons. And boy, is that worrying. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and walk on over to that subscribe button and touch it. It's free. It won't cost you anything. But for now, that's all I have for you today. Bye. Subscribe.